Hey everyone, JT here, back with another video. A few videos ago, I promised to tell you how we resolved our problem of having a lot of battery storage, but too small an inverter. The answer was really simple. We took the two small inverters, we separated all of the panels from them, we decommissioned those inverters, they're currently sitting on the floor right here, and we installed a brand new 10 kilowatt inverter. At the same time, we added a third battery, so that now gives us 29 kilowatts of battery storage and a 10 kilowatt inverter. And this has resolved all of our problems. We are now 99% off grid. But that doesn't mean we don't need the grid. And today's a perfect example of why. It is blowing a gale outside. It's a lovely sunny day. The solar panels are working well, but the electricity prices are going down and down and down. And the reason is, is out in the North Sea, there are some very large wind turbines that are producing huge amounts of power and that electricity isn't required at the moment. So rather than turn the turbines off, our electricity company, Octopus, offers us low price electricity. And on days like today, that price is negative. So we actually get used for importing energy from the grid. So today we're going to talk a little bit about what I call the battery game and how we can maximize our profits, and they're only small profits, but any profits are profit, from our batteries and make sure that we're going to take advantage of these windy days when there's a lot of free power going. Okay, so we've run back into the office because A, it's a little cut quieter in here, but um, I want to be able to show you an application that I use on my iPad that's also available on the iPhone. It's called Octopus Watch. Now this is a, a free application. It does have a subscription tier. I think the subscription is like £7.99 a year. Um, and for that, I get a lot of value out of it. But Octopus Watch gives me some information about my tariff. I have to put my, uh, my Octopus credentials in and it will pull all the information about my tariff. Now, as I mentioned earlier, I use a tariff called Octopus Agile. This tracks the wholesale rate of electricity and every 30 minutes I have a different price for my electricity. So you can see here in Octopus Watch, um, I'm using about 51 watts of power right now. We've used 0.1 kilowatts so far today. The current rate is 8.02 pence per kilowatt hour and it's currently going down. So if I scroll down a little bit, you'll see I get a graph that graph is showing me the price on the left hand side is what it is right now and then the solid red line are the actual actual prices over the next uh, day. In fact it's up until 4 p.m. today. The dotted line after that is a prediction. Now the prediction is sometimes pretty accurate and sometimes it's way off but we're con going to concentrate on that actual red line because that's the prices that Octopus have set. Okay, if we scroll down a little bit, you'll see we've got prices for every half hour slot um, up until 4 p.m. today. And on the right hand side there, you can see the price for that 30 minute period. And then there's a little green, blue and other times of the day when the price is very expensive, that will be red um, if it's an expensive period. But what we're interested in today are those blue sections because blue means it's zero or below. Now, if we look at the first slot there, the first slot is at 9.30 to 10.30 this morning. It is minus 2.2 pence per kilowatt hour. That means I can pull in a kilowatt hour of power and Octopus will give me 2.2 pence for that kilowatt hour. So in theory, if I charge up all of my batteries, um, now I'm not going to do that in a half an hour period, but as you can see later on in the day, we've got a three to four hour period where we can actually... Uh, import power at a negative rate. And this is where the battery game comes in because if you've got the time, now it does take some time each day to sit down, look at these numbers, come up with a game plan, you can actually make money every single day that there are low or negative prices because normal price to import power if you're on a tariff like uh, Octopus Intelligent Go at night time is going to be seven pence a kilowatt hour. So today, I don't think, other than that first slot from 7.30 in the morning all the way through till 4 o'clock this afternoon, it never goes above um, about 2 pence. So that's a perfect time to be pulling in power. Hey, JC here from the future. It's now 11.30 in the morning. 
Now, what I'm going to do is show you my My Energy application. And what you can see here is we have 10 kilowatts of power flowing in from the grid and flowing into my batteries. Because the prices are now negative, we're going to be using that power to charge up the batteries as we go. But we're not losing the solar generation either. If I look at my Solar Edge app, you'll see the solar panels are generating a nearly another 5 kilowatts, and that's also flowing into the batteries as well. While all of this is happening, it's costing me minus 0.44p per kilowatt hour. So I'm being paid for all of that power that I'm pulling in from the grid. Anyway, back to JT earlier this morning. In power, And when it's negative, you're getting paid for doing it. So not only will I be charging my batteries today, I'll also be charging my electric cars and doing the washing and putting the dishwasher on and everything I can to use as much power as I physically can during those free periods. And then at the end of the day, I'll go and take a look into the Octopus app and we'll be able to see how much money we made. So if I fire up the Octopus app now, what you'll see, um, first of all, is it will show me today. But let's go back to yesterday because we had a similar situation yesterday. So my cost for electricity yesterday was minus 3.6 pence. Now, again, this is not a lot of money and you probably could make an argument that the amount of effort involved for minus three pence doesn't really make it worth your while. But over time, these all add up. And there are days, certainly days during the winter, when we have a nice sunny day with a lot of wind that you will see prices, I've seen them go as minus, minus 15 pence a kilowatt hour. Now, you pull in 30 kilowatts during that time, you can start to really offset some of your other electricity costs. So that's the battery game. That's how I play it. And every day I'll take a look at my Octopus uh, Watch app. I will make a plan. I will then go into my Solar Edge app and I will configure my battery to charge at those particular times. Now, there is another element to the battery game, which is the discharge game. But we'll talk about that in another video. I hope you found that useful. If you do want to change over to Octopus Energy, you are in the UK and you, something like the Agile Tariff is something you think will be useful to you, then please do use the referral code. I will put it on the bottom of the screen. I will also put it in the description below. That referral code will get you £50 of credit onto your new account, and it will also give me £50 of credit for referring you. With that, I hope you found this useful, and if I'm lucky, I'll see you back here for the next video.